As transportation issues arose, we learned to ride the old inventions of the past better. While getting better at riding a bike, the motor ones I needed more training. <laughs> <laughs> to meet with my animal contacts wasn't always easy. I sometimes had to go to them rather than them to me. The robin offered intel about how some foods processed in countries that hated the U.S. There were cases of tainted food. In exchange for intel, she wasn't greedy. She just wanted to make sure that her family was fed. However, I made the mistake of throwing bread at her nest, thinking that it would be okay to land some bread in her nest for her and her family to feast on. She complained that she would rather have whole wheat bread than plain white bread. Getting more bread up her tree was scary. I should have used my anti-gravity shoes. Had I used the anti-gravity devices connected to my shoes, connected to objects like a broom, I'm sure I would have confirmed to some locals' minds that the old legends about witches riding brooms just might have some truth to them. Such tales about miraculous and curious modes of travel hinted to cosmic agents' activities in the past later turned into legends and myths. Hey, I got some bread, I got some bread, uh, I'll give some bread, give me some intel, you got some intel, give me some bread, I'll give you some intel, intel, intel you smell. Hey, 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 My animal contacts warned me about how there were some animals who were being used by evil forces to gather intel too. I continued seeking out the contacts that some of the other animals referred me to. Some of them didn't want to get involved, fearing that the other animals that were working for the evil forces would come after them. The goose wanted to pose and have me pass on the footage and have it become ads and historical heroic history 
in the future as to how the intel he offered helped to save the planet from global killers of global killer weapons. There was a park nearby a scientific lab that the workers would come and talk secret talks, make deals and exchange top secret information, not believing that the animals would ever be able to understand and pass on to agents like me, the scientists greedy plans to let out secrets to global killer weapons being worked on. Well, Kirk and I were out in the wooded areas training and getting ready for a mission to look into the global killer weapons being manufactured. Universal Mission Command sent us a rookie that wasn't so rookie. As we tested him, he seemed to defy gravity as though he had anti-gravity shoes on his feet. He had been trained in the ancient martial arts from old Earth's history a Brazilian style called capoeira. He taught us and we taught him. <laughs> 